Why can I not possess the rat? Because I don't have enough mana. And I don't have any more potions. <sighs> well, son of a... Okay. Okay. I can do this. is this one right there Mind me. Well, that's a better hiding spot than where I had. Jerk burger. <laughs> and you go to sleep. <laughs> That guy's gonna have a headache in the morning. There's the meeting chamber, and there's where the instructions are supposed to be. Oh, I want that rune down there. That one that's almost assuredly right in there. It's down. It's in the basement. I go. those fools at Coldridge for letting Corvo get away. Who knows what the man could do now? Hiram, or Lord Regent, as he asks us to call him now, 
seems to have faith in all the Sokolov security devices he's put up all over the city, but... Well, bras everywhere. Not so sure. At least the girl has been moved to a safe place. Visiting her twice a week has given me ample opportunity to inspect the facilities, as they say. So there's an upside, at least. I don't know what's to say. Campbell, I'm not sure how my predecessor operated, but from now on, if one of my girls tries to blackmail you, you send her back to me at the Golden Cat instead of concocting some plan on your own. I've had to replace three girls in as many months, and you can imagine the business of Colonel Pleasure isn't booming in this city, in this plague-stricken hole you call a city. Madden Prudence. Break. Yes. Mine. Mine. Don't care. Can I dig this? Five out of seven runes, does that just mean here or for right now? That's where I was before. What's this? Don't care. <coughs> what do you have to say, Hart? If those guys are still chatting. Yep. Looks that way. Sorry, I keep moving the mic up and down whenever I cough, and sometimes I forget to move it back or the other way. <coughs> I'm still sick. Huh. The meeting chamber is in there. The archive is back there, so okay. All I have to do is go around. Perfect. You son of a. Hehe. <laughs> Sleepy time for you. Okay, sleepy time. <laughs> Whoops. Hey, look you what I found. You just uh, sleep over there right now. The heretic brand is reserved for overseers who have committed heinous acts against the order, but have not broken codes that would otherwise result in execution. No contact, aid, or shelter can be given to one bearing that brand. That person is forevermore unwelcome to the abbey and its affiliates. When used, the brand is applied to the forehead so all can see the sins of the recipient. The chemical compound acts immediately, scarring the heretic for the remainder of life. The interrogation room here at the office of the High Overseer stands ready for branding ritual should the need arise. The recipient must be strapped into the interrogation chair and restrained as the brand is applied. The heretic brand itself is to be stored in the same room. That's clear enough. But why Corvo? The one man feared throughout the Empire. He's as bloody minded as they say. Left a trail of bodies. And the way he dodged the axe. We can't rule up to black magic. He had help, yes. But how far does it go? The trail goes to Martin. But Martin knows everything. Everything. I wonder 
if I can, uh... He's dead. <coughs> Probably not the best course of action. I'll admit. Is this the interrogation room? Well, I'll be. Sleepy guy. Okay, on uh, that note, I need to pause this for a second. Let me just make sure all's well. Good, 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 good. Alright, I shall return. <coughs> 